Okay, let's decode, let's break down how Bowden Parrott does the cross-field kick. Here he is, beautifully flighted, literally straight into the arms of his teammate. And we are across the line for the try. Okay, let's take it all back. And let's actually see what happens here and work out how we can kick like Bowden Barrett. Now, as he receives the ball, he starts to do something really good here. What you will notice is that he has already, if we take it back a little bit here, he's already aligned his body beautifully with the direction in which he intends to kick it. You will notice that he has both hips, shoulders, arms, everything pointing in the right direction. It's the first thing he does that is very, very important for the accuracy and the line that your kick goes on. Now, the next thing I want to point out here, which is really good, is he has a beautiful ball drop. Look at that. You will notice, you will notice in that ball drop, just watch this. Look at the ball drop. This ball will keep its line beautifully. So here we go. Look at that. It literally stays on its line. Now, the next big thing to check out here is to actually have a look how low he comes with this ball. Because obviously, if he had kicked, if his contact point was much higher, let's say if he was uh, touching, kicking the ball at, the, say, this height, he's going to get a much, much higher arc like this. And he's going to get way too much distance. What he's done here clearly is he's kicked a beautiful line like this to get the length across the field but to quickly get it there so that his winger, his outside back can grab that ball and make their way to the try line. So what you'll notice here is he's dropped it quite low and he's used a real stab kick to do this. So if we just rewind it a little bit here, watch how he actually snaps his leg back almost immediately after the kick. So he comes through, beautiful ball drop as we said, he kicks and look how quickly he brings that kicking leg back and that's going to be really important because he's going to keep essentially this line here. He's not going to go past it. And what that means is he doesn't put too much body weight into the kick, doesn't send it too far perhaps over the sideline. He weights it just perfectly. And then what you will notice is that this ball just has the most beautiful flight to it. So we'll see it entering here, coming down for his teammate right there. And... The important thing to recognize here, he's got that beautiful end-over-end end, end end spin, which pretty much makes this one of the hardest things to defend. So here goes his teammate across the line. It's all over Red Rover, and that's how Bowden Barrett kicks.